Docked at the State Pier in Portsmouth, the USS Manchester is a 420-foot-long, state-of-the-art warship. The other great thing about having lots of room, which a lot of ships don't have, is we have room for a pretty big gym. But there's more than iron beefing up the Navy's newest vessel. It's equipped with 50 and 62 caliber machine guns for short-range self-defense and a landing pad that fits up to two helicopters for rescue or relief missions. From the deck plates, we have the ability to adapt. So when we are given a mission that may or may not be the primary mission for which the ship was built, we get it done. Instead of propellers, thrusters help the 3,000 ton vessel reach speeds exceeding 40 knots or roughly 11 miles per hour faster than a battleship. Because of our draft, we can get into ports that uh, larger destroyers and cruisers can't visit and operate in areas that uh, these bigger ships can't go. On Saturday, thousands will celebrate the USS Manchester's commissioning. Nashua native Lieutenant Adrian Pinkasik and Petty Officer Larissa Noyes of Derry will lead special tours for family and friends. And I try to explain to my family what I do and they, they don't quite get it and I'm excited for them to come here and see, oh, this is, this is what she's been working for for the past three years. I think uh, a lot of people don't know about the Granite State because we're kind of small and we're kind of far up north. Uh, so it's been really awesome to share my community with everybody else. Once it docks in San Diego, the first mission for the 70 member crew will be to detect and destroy ocean mines. Mike Cherry, WMUR News 9.